Alrighty guys, Rex here. Today we're going to talk about the Eighth Commandment. Okay, this is a pretty straightforward one. It is, thou shall not steal. So don't steal. Pretty easy deal right there. Unless you're like, uh, some of these guys are like bank robbers and I know how fun it is, you know, to get the adrenaline built up and mug people in the alley and all that stuff, but that's not cool. So don't steal. If you don't mind stealing from other people, then you should have no problem when people do it to you. And that's kind of the way the universe works, man. If you're stealing stuff, eventually someone's going to steal something from you. There's a lot of kleptomaniacs out there who kind of, that's kind of their thing. Um, and then they're, they get bent out of shape if someone steals their stuff. So what goes around comes around. It's just, a, it's a straightforward deal. Back in the old days, the way it worked, if you would get caught stealing something... You would go before the judges and you'd have a diligent inquiry to make sure that you're actually guilty of stealing it. And if they found you guilty of stealing it, you would have to pay it back immediately seven times over whatever the value of the object was. So you'd either get back the object that you stole and then seven times that. Unless the person you stole from had like a good forgiving heart and you showed repentance, like sincere repentance for stealing it, they could forgive your debt the seven times over part, and all they had to do is give you back what they stole. And so that's the way that God's law used to work back in the days. Nowadays, they throw people in this big cage so they can feel sorry for themselves when they get caught stealing stuff, and then they create this criminal industrial complex called the modern injustice system or whatever, right? Just throw them in a cage, that'll teach them. God's justice didn't work that way. If they caught someone stealing something, you'd pay it back immediately. If they couldn't afford to pay back because they burned it all or, or used it all up or whatever, then they would be enslaved to you as, you know, under endangered servitude. They would have to work under the supervision of the society and pay back what they owed you until it was paid back. So if they didn't have the cash to actually pay you back, then they, they are working for you, okay? Just like a pretty good deal. It's good, like reparations, you know, kind of situation. So... Thou shall not steal. Not super hard. Um, there's a lot of people on subtle levels who think it's okay to steal because it's a non-human entity like a corporation or whatever job they're working for, etc. Just don't do it, okay? It's uh, what, what goes around comes around. Easy commandment, right? Let's move on to the next one, which is one uh, that I believe is very important as well. 